Hello there beautiful people, I hope you're doing well. Welcome back again to On How Channel. For people that don't know, my name is Enes, I'm working for you. So if you have any questions, any video requests, make sure to drop on the line a comment, I will be happy to make a video for you. And for people that do know, welcome back. Please be a witness for that for over 200 now videos on Shopify customization because they were mostly requested by you guys, I mean subscribers. Some people not even subscribers, but I'm fine with that. I still make the video for them, as always. Just a like button, that's all I'm asking. Or actually, hold on for a second. If you are interested in Shopify customization, you want to be an expert, you want to learn how to do anything yourself without having to hire a developer, why not subscribe to the channel, man? I don't have anything to sell, I don't sell any courses, never will. I don't have any paid memberships on the channel. So every little thing I do create, the codes and the videos and everything, I post them completely free on the channel. And not just random videos, I actually post videos that people request, questions and a lot of issues that people have with their Shopify store. So it's a win-win situation. I let you decide, it's your decision. Now I respect your decision. Just a like button if this video helped you out. If it didn't, just drop me a comment. I will be happy to provide you the information you need in order to do the thing you're trying to do. And here I am again, back with another requested video, as always, which is how to make a single specific menu item on the header bold on your Shopify store and either the menu header or even the drop-down menu items. So if you want to make a specific menu item on the drop-down menu on the header, this video will help you out. I mean, if you want to make a bold, this video will help you out. And if you want to make like a, a main menu bold, a specific main menu bold, this video will help you out as well. And we will do that by the same code. I will show you just how to customize it a little bit to make it work either on this uh, one of the items on the drop down menu or uh, one of the main menus. And without any more talking, let's just jump to it. As you can see, this is the Shopify dashboard. And I have here down team, which is the one I do demonstrations on. So every code I do create or every tutorial I do create, I do demonstration in the video on down team because it's the most used one, also is the most requested one. But if I scroll down in here, I have every other free Shopify team, the most used ones again, which is refresh, spotlight, taste, stance, and trade. And if you are wondering why is that, because I do actually try the codes behind the scenes on all of these teams. So I'd make sure that even if you're not using down team, you're using one of these, should work for you just fine. And I don't do that in the video, I do it behind the scenes so I don't bore the people. It's gonna be like a half hour video. And I just have to say this in the beginning because you're gonna see me doing it on down team in the video and you might be thinking, oh, maybe it's not working for the others. No, it is. And here is your peace of mind and without of the way, you just get to and show you how to make a single specific menu item from bold on your Shopify store or even one of the drop down menu items bold. And this is the Shopify store where I do all the tricks. So every little thing that you see in the Shopify store, I did it in tutorials, literally everything. So if you saw anything here that you liked and you think it looks good and you want to implement it in your store as well, then just check out the channel because once it's here, that means it's already done and posted in one of my previous videos because I don't remove the changes from here. I keep them so people can see them. But what I'm talking about here is this guy's right here. Oh yeah, hover color, I did that in the video. Arranging the spacing on the menu, I did that in the video. And also making it a center, I did that in the video. Even the icon, check it out. The icon for the main menu, for the drop down menu, one of the items, I did that in the video as well. So what I'm talking about, I will show you how to make one of these bold, one of these bold, only one of these, not the whole, the whole menu. And I will show you how to make one of these bold as well, one of the drop down menus item. So obviously we will keep this page open do the trick, come back and see it in action. So get back to Shopify dashboard. After that, if you are in the Shopify dashboard, click on online store teams, then click on three dots on left of customize and click on edit code. And it will take you to the code editor for your Shopify team. And in here, instead of looking at the folders, you might get dizzy or something, use the search bar at the top left corner. And again, I have to mention this each time for the million times, it's gonna be either base.css or team.css or style.css. And some rarely custom made teams gonna be custom.css, but mostly they use base or style or team. In my case, I know it's base, so I pin base, here it is. Base.css, click on it, bunch of CSS code will show up, scroll all the way down after that. Let me drag this because it's a huge file. Here we go. So after that, we need to create some, some space to paste in our code. To create that space, click front of the last thing in here. In my case, uh, is a closing bracket. Click front of it, then click on enter on your keyboard. Here we go. We have a completely new line to paste in our code. And where are you gonna get that code? 
as always from the description box scroll down the description box and you will see a link name it as code click on it and it will take you to this page where you're going to see this very very short code as you can see so this code will do actually both you just have to customize it a little bit i will show you how to do that so select the whole code right click copy then we will get back in here and paste it at the bottom of the file so right now let me zoom in on it so you can see clearly so it says header menu categories uh, main menu so in my case i did set it i did type in here categories because i have the drop down on the menu categories so make sure if you have like the drop down named as a catalog for example make sure to to type in here catalog and this is if you want to implement it uh, you want to make one of these drop down menu items the bold if you want to do that make sure to rename the categories here to the uh, main menu drop down here that has the drop down in my case as i said is categories and next in here it says main menu as you can see so in here obviously you're going to type in the item that you want to make it bold let me pick one of these let me go for shoes for example as you can see it says here shoes so i'm going to type in here shoes in the main menu simply shoes like this now let's just click on save button and see what that what okay it's save it now so let's just reload the page if i click on categories now check it out now the shoe now, shoes now menu is bold as you can see and only the shoes menu because that's what exactly what the type in here so if i want it not the drop down menu i want one of these to be bold for example let's just go for catalog let's just say you want i want this catalog to be bold not this shoes or anyone else so what we'll get back in here and you see here it says categories we will remove the whole thing remove the whole thing make sure to keep only this dash front of the header menu and front of it simply type in the thing you want to bold in my case is catalog as i said let me get back in here to see yeah it's catalog so now if i click on save button wait for a couple of seconds it's save it and we get back in here let's just reload the page here we go now it's only catalog that's actually bold as you can see and not the drop down that we did create oops not this one this one as you can see back to the normal form and that's how you make a specific header menu item bold either on drop down or main menu on your shopify store by using our own custom code and a single code actually so if you have any questions make sure to drop them below but for now i think my job is done so thanks for watching catch you on the next one